Welcome back everyone, we're in Act 2, just uh, sold all of our stuff and uh, double checked all of our equipment. Uh, I'm just going to run through my uh, skills very quickly. Um, don't want to do frost hide, that would kind of be funny getting a ton of them out. Uh, disintegrate, still very happy with that. Slow time. Could do point of no return, but uh, likewise quite happy. Mocking demise, that's what I want. I want my mirror images to explode when they die. The energy armor is not quite there. We need to be level 54 for that. And uh, we're quite happy with the spark glint. So we'll keep pretty much as we are for the moment. Right, straight on to the desolate sands, I think. We've only got uh, one and a half levels to go uh, before level 50, so hopefully we'll end on a high note and not a dead note. <laughs> level one. <laughs> high note of the number of deaths. Don't walk into those massive uh, piles of death. Um, yeah, they don't really bother me. But thanks for the warning. Nothing. You hear that? Your defenses are nothing. I just picked up the Crusaders Part 8 twice. Twice? That's impressive. Yeah. It drops twice from the same monster. Maybe you got my one. Well, I imagine you've got to read Part 1 through 7 first. Yeah, probably. On this character. Yep, it's up this way. I see. Leave him be! We don't care about that one. I love this, my uh, armor is electrocuting and setting fire to things. Okay, I'll come back. Found it! I become more powerful. These caves stink of worm slime and rotting meat. Delicious rotting meat. I wonder if the galvanizing ward is uh, calculated based on a percentage of your maximum life or a percentage of, um, you know, like uh, a formula based on your level. Simple way to find out. Take off your armor. Maybe in town. So 
much stuff. Depressingly low number of uniques today. Well, that was inconvenient that they pushed me away. Really lost my flow. Frozen. Waters fast minions. Not as fast anymore. Let's go straight on to Zoltan Cool, the Cursed Pit. Did you want to kill Cool while you're p passing? Eh, yeah, we can do. Fruit Savers part nine. We say this part two. <laughs> that the high level cleric of the Zakarun named Akai began to sense the corruption that was eating away at the heart of his faith. I should be able to lend you my copy once I've read it. Oh, no, the way you read, probably not. Exploding part, damn. The Matrix, why are the pages all sticky? With this soul stone, I will finally be able to unlock the true power of man. In ancient times, our kind possessed Level power 15. unmatched in this dreary age. Did you want to change up your skills? Uh, not my skills, it'll be uh, my equipment when we go back to town. Huh. Probably. I just suspect that there's a new skill that might be interesting, but not interesting enough to change off what I've got at the moment. I want to I can do... No, can't do that until level 56. <laughs> Bloody thing! Stay still! You're not a fly swatter. That was a spider anyway, wasn't it? I don't know. It died. You just need to hit it once and then it sets on fire. Uh, should Can we kill the cackling in the distance? That's these things. Oh, right. I'm an illusionist too! Ah! Just up. Oh dear. There we go. Still waiting. I am so good. I astound myself. I ran out of arcane power. I'm going to pause for a second. There we go. And we did it, but... We could have done so much more if I had my syndicate still. Thank 
Okay, uh, let's uh, go kill Cool and then head back to town quickly. Okay. Yes, a unique one. Congratulations. That's quite cool. Huh, but can key. Uh, yeah, I suppose. Plus eighty six point nine percent damage on my current weapon. Yeah. I am returning to town. And that gives me an excuse to make that offhand that I wanted as well. Okay, so let's go to Shen and let's remove this gem. Or just salvage that old thing. No, I want Soul Smasher. Oh, okay, yeah, fair enough. Okay, there. Right, I'm going to swap out Ancestor's Grace for a different amulet. Would you like it back? <laughs> um, yes. So I have one. Forge Singularity. Right, let's make a couple of these. Probably going to be using it for a while. I want something that increases my disintegrate damage by 14%. Ah, 12%, that'll do. Reduce the resource cost by 5%, that's lovely. And critical hits grant me arcane power. That one might be worth uh, taking over to the enchanter. And seeing what we can do with today. it. Range to the attackers, take damage per hit. That. Yeah, let's search uh, this. Monster kills for Grant plus 97 experience, that'll do for the moment. 1.1% uh, chance to slow hit, that's better than a kick teeth Yeah, I'm gonna 
keep the uh, experience. But that's very cool. My damage is 13,000 now. Oh, cool. Lost Boy's boots. Yeah, so. I can do with this uh, one. Swap out the two forty four intelligence and see if we get intelligence. 244 or 243. <laughs> 252, take that. 264, perfect. Well, not perfect, but <laughs> a lot better. 269 is the most I can get on it. How was that? And drop off these things. Uh, that's fine. And right, let's put. One of those in there. Fourteen thousand four hundred thirteen damage. Hydra, that's fine. Disintegrate, that's fine. Slow time, that's fine. Mirror image is exploding like I wanted to. Energy armor, it can't do till level 54. Change the familiar over for an Arcanot, which would uh, probably allow me to just disintegrate forever. But would you do less disintegrate damage then? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, ten percent less. Oh right, so galvanizing ward um, does eight thousand two hundred seventeen damage protection, or dominance, killing an enemy grants a shield that absorbs one thousand six hundred twenty-two damage for three seconds, which can stack ten times, and each time it stacks and increases the duration by half a second, mm, and that's resets not very... and resets the duration. That's still not very long. Well, it means like uh, after ten times, it will be eight seconds for you to kill the next enemy. Yes, which is not very long at all. Yeah. Going into the first fight, you won't have it. That's a very good point. I suppose galvanizing is better for that. All right, straight on with the uh, howling plateau. <laughs> I love that we both banished at the same time. This is going to be interesting to see uh, how much faster my Hydra attacks. If it gets a chance. <laughs> I shall make it my life's work to kill everything your Hydra is trying to kill before it <laughs> gets off shots. What's your uh, damage level at the moment? Um, 18,000. Oh, so not that much higher than mine now. No, but I am only 5 levels higher than you now. Oh, yeah, you're friendly. Mostly. Damn these little things. Maybe I should change over for a lightning hydra that, you know, it's just instant hit.
How about a disintegrate hydro? Oh, that would be amazing. I am unstoppable. Or a hydro that gains the effect of every rune. You know, so it's giant and shoots three different kinds of uh, of things, one from each head. That would be fun. Okay, I'll watch your back like that other guy, but seriously, <laughs> do you not want us to defend you? Stop punching his back. <laughs> I watch things with my fists. Oh, you're blind. <laughs> that makes so much more sense. Blindfolded, not blind. I think I got it. Yes, I got it. Nah, still stuck. <laughs> One of the fallen just flew at my camera. Take my share, and you can have what's left. Yoink. Well, that's pretty good for a couple of extra monsters. more mobs to hand the boss because we've not killed it this time. I become more powerful. That uh, extra experience that I've got stacked is really starting to show now. Yes. <laughs> I've got like a hundred on my uh, main hand, a hundred on my off hand and a hundred on my boots. Oh you're actually probably gonna start leveling up past me then. Once we've uh, killed this uh, thing, I'll uh, find out exactly how much it is. Uh, 500 bonus experience per kill, 229.9%. So cool. Yeah, the 229.9% is basically just... Bonus. Yeah. Right, on to the uh, stinging winds. Uh, Pop-up just said cow level is a lie. It's a shame they're not exploding anymore. And I could change to the disintegrate that does the explosion, but I like it hitting as many things as possible. And isn't the uh, range of the disintegrate explosion you said was much smaller? Yeah, it's, it's six yards, but they'll still explode. Which is better than not exploding. There's a necromancer. Hey, it's Mr. Diablo 2. <laughs> Look, he's got a skeleton. Brings a necromancer to this forsaken desert. Powerful spirits haunt these ruins. 
I was not strong enough to defeat them. But I was if you dare. You can try to put them. Yeah, whatever. Can you hear their angry voices? Still more remain. One more left. This guy sounds like uh, Jorah from Games of Thrones. Well, that wasn't hard. Be able to work his magic. The voices fade. The spirits in this place are calm. I can begin the work of freeing them. Come on, then. The of the spirits wait. Listen. The common. We have denied the coven, but I fear they will find other. Thank you. And Woohoo! Two decades ago, my mentor faced the forces of evil and emerged victorious. I cannot hope to surpass his achievements, but I will try to bring balance to the raging forces that threaten to tear the world asunder in these days. The spirits are restless near Chaldeum. I must quiet them. That was very explosive. Alright. On to Arcanus. Magda! This would be fun. Alright. Can I change my slow time over for an even slower, slower one? Slower time. Time, Michelle. Right, let's see if we can lock her in place. It is with some reluctance that I write on the seven lords of hell, for they are the greatest of the demons, and even whispering their names seems to poison the air around me. They are divided into the lesser evils, Belial, Asmodan, Juriel, and Andaril, and the prime evils, Mephisto, Baal, and Diablo. Ooh, explosive. <laughs> if only they could see me now. Also explosive. Yep. <laughs> Keeping carefully far I away from everything. Onwards. Yeah, got it. Tales have reached me of your truly abysmal failure to stop the enemy at the Cassim outpost. But at least the enemy is. Cool. 
Kind of annoying that she hid behind that bit, but... <laughs> That's alright, she hid in the, the, the little place with me. Punch, 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 punch. In the end, I just stepped around the corner and I was like, Oh, disintegrate, whatever. World. What do we get, what do we get? Uh, nothing. But I am going to salvage all of these down and then start talking to Kandala because I've got 350 shards now. Fortune favors the bold. Does it indeed? What are we going to go for? We could go for a helm. We could go for some shoulder. Maybe some shoulder. What? I didn't even know I had that thing. Well, that's good for running away. I mean, pads. Okay, how about chest armor? Maybe we can get another syndicate. See you soon. What a steal! Don't forget, luck Nothing. always changes. Luck always changes until Dala doesn't fave you anymore. Okay, I can use Cataclysm now. Which is less damage. Oh no, it's slightly more damage than my current thing, but a lot less toughness and a lot less recovery, so I'm going to forgo that for the moment. Right, I think that's uh, quite a good opportunity for us to call an end to that episode. Thank you very much for tuning in and see you soon.